right, so today we have here the Kendall remodel. This is one of the most anticipated remodels in all of Creatures of Scenaria, and this is also probably one of my favorite creatures in Creatures of Scenaria. Right off the bat, the model looks kind of like the original model, but also like similar to the other model, like the model we had before. It is, it's a bipedal now, so it's standing on two legs, much like a dinosaur, rather than the four-legged crocodile look it had before. But when it runs, the running animation, it goes down on all fours again. So it's kind of like a combination of both versions of the Kendall into one. But um, I was always more of a fan of the dinosaur look it had before. And right now, it doesn't look like any specific dinosaur. I want to say it looks like a Spinosaur, but it does not have a spine. The head looks kind of like a Gorgosaurus, I'd say, from um, Walking with Dinosaurs. You can tell by like the shape of the head. And the rest of the body is just extremely bulky. It has like gigantic spikes on its back and along its tail. And uh, let's check out some of its animations. So right now we have the typical walking animation. Not too much going on around here. And we already saw it from before, the sprinting animation does have it go down on all fours. Although it is a bit slow, which I guess makes sense because this is a pretty big creature. Let's see the attack animation. It's pretty basic, it's just like a bite. And uh, let's see the aggro animation now. Oh, nice. So the aggro animation also goes down on all fours. And then we have the cower animation. Interesting. So the cower animation, it kind of just like sits down. That's what it looks like it's doing. And then we have the sit animation. Well, the cower animation and the sit animation is basically the same thing, it looks like. And the rest animation. So it really lies down like all the way on its stomach now. So as for abilities, this guy does have a few. It has the dart ability, and I'm pretty sure this guy can still break bones just like before. I don't know if they balance this guy's stats too much. You can check out the stats right here. I am not fully grown yet, but uh, my stats are pretty decent. It does a lot of damage, and the weight is quite a bit. All right, now that we found some water, let's see the swimming animation. So this is the swimming animation. Looks pretty cool. Now, if I can just dive down underwater. Hmm, there you go. It does swim pretty slow, though, so there's that. And then this is the sprint swim animation. Actually, looks pretty different. It starts moving its uh, arms. And that's really about it for all of Kendall's animations. We have not heard the roars yet, so let's hear it right now. That's uh, the number seven roar. This is the number eight. And the number nine. And this is zero. So one thing about creatures of Scenario is that these creatures don't really have roar animations. All of the roars kind of just have the same mouth opening animation. It would be cool if they had like an aggro animation of its own every time it does the roar or whatever sound effects your creature has. But uh, yeah, let's play around as this guy, see how life as a Kendall is like on Creatures of Scenario. All right, it looks like we bumped into this little flying creature. I'm not sure what it is exactly. Comment down in the chat if you know what creature. Let's see if, oh, what is he doing? He's getting closer. Okay, he's flying pretty close. That guy does look familiar though. I'm pretty sure I've, I definitely played as this creature before, I just don't remember the name. Alright, it looks like to be interested in the meat. Let me see if I can approach it without scaring it too much. I wonder which, uh, which roar is the friendly one? Let me see if I could figure out using the emotes. Uh, vocal calls? Friendly, here we go. Uh, is this guy still scared of me? I used the friendly roar. Uh, this Kendall is able to grab, by the way, by just pressing one, so I guess he's scared that I'm just gonna grab him. Let's see again. Friendly roar. Oh, there's- is that another Kendall? 
That looks like another Kendall. So let's, uh, let's approach our fellow Kendall, see what happens. Um, he is grabbing a big chunk of meat. I hope this guy does not attack me. We look like to be the same size. So that's, it'll be bad if we get into a fight. You think you'll let me have some of the meat? Carnivore carcass, 59. Let me see what happens if I eat part of it. Huh, he's letting me eat the meat. Nice. He's letting me eat the meat. Hey, yo. And this little guy, he's just standing around, I guess. Eh, he's still keeping his distance, I guess is smart. Is that, is that grass? Can I eat grass? It says I can eat it. Oh, never mind. Only herbivores can eat grass. It would've been funny if there was an option to actually eat the grass. And, uh, oh, where did the, uh, where did the other Kendall go? That, that's weird. Kendall's usually move pretty slow. This is my fastest speed. Is it the menu or something like that? Fruit. Huh. Can I pick up a cherry? I can pick up a cherry, even though I am not a, uh, herbivore. I don't think I could eat it, though. Yeah, I can't eat it. I could just put it back down, I guess. Nope, picking up more. How do I put this stuff back down? Cheese put down. Uh, am I putting it down? Ah, there we go. Put down the cherry. And this looks like it's mud. I think I can actually hide my scent. This is the mud roll animation, by the way. I didn't really show it before because I didn't think it was too important. But my scent is now hidden, which is nice. And this is the drinking animation, which I also didn't showcase. But, uh, yeah. And is that little guy following me? I wonder. Where did he go? Oh, he's over there. And there's a- is that another Kendall? That's a baby Kendall, right? Let me see if I could friendly call this guy. He's walking- oh, whoa! Okay, there's another creature here. What is this? This one looks familiar. Ah, uh, I don't- I definitely recognize the creature, it's just I, I don't know the name. And, uh, I guess these guys are friends, they don't look like to be attacking each other. Maybe, is, is that a high ghost? I could be completely wrong, but that thing looks like a high ghost, I don't know. Just a wild guess out there. And, oh wow, that is another Kendall right up there. It looks like everyone is- oh! Nice, we unlocked the uh, stamina regen tree. I guess that's what happens when we become fully grown. I can become elder, but for now I'm gonna... Should I become elder? You know what, let's, let's become elder. See what happens. Uh, okay, it looks like we got... A little bigger, maybe? The thing with elders is that it changes the stats, so I think you become like a lot slower, even though you're... Uh, you get like a whole extra hundred to your age. Okay, please, no, no, please don't kill me. Uh, I'm gonna have to fight back. Uh, our health is melting right now, and he got the first hit. This is bad. Please, please don't. Well, our Kendall died. Well, at least we got the showcase off. Hey, the little guy, he's, is he gonna help me? And it looks like we survived, uh, 21 minutes as the Kendall. Um, we got, like, no points. We got, uh, did we even get enough for this? We got the random trial creature token, and that's it. We did not get enough of anything else but uh yeah that, i guess that concludes our video our kendall died i hope you guys enjoyed and i'll see you in the next one